This question and nobody answered me, so next time I do that, y'all hit it up you do that. <laughs> because I had to come up with these ideas all on my own. So, here we go. Question one All right, who should pay on the first date? Who should pay on the first date? That's that's not hard. That's not hard. Um, if it were me, I would always pay on the first date. Mm -hmm. But if you like to listen to my boy Anthony O'Neill, if it ain't in your budget, y'all should just split it. What? I mean, there's guys out there don't have a lot of money. I'm leaving that day. <laughs> I'm just saying, if you ain't got the money to pay for it. Why are you going on the date in the first place? Because, you know, you met this girl at work and you were like, hey, and she's like, hey, and y'all are like, let's go out to eat. No, then you can say, okay, hang on, give me like two weeks because I broke. No, you can't tell a girl to give me two weeks because girls move fast. No, we don't. Yes, you do. Okay, anyway. Next question. I think we're going to go with your first answer. That I will pay first. I know, but I will pay first. That's easy. <laughs> Question two What's the most attractive thing about a girl? Their mind. You can see their brain. No, you know what I mean. Um, <laughs> the most attractive thing about women is their mind. Y'all have a very complicated, very emphasis, complicated mind. But at the same time, it's a beautiful mess. It's a mess. All right. Next question. Mm -hmm. What's the next question? Is more makeup or less makeup better? Less or makeup. no makeup? Mm -hmm. Like a lot? A little bit or none at all. None at all. Really? Yeah. Alright. As we have a girl, yeah. what's your mom? <laughs> <laughs> this is Katie, oh. guys. Oh, you See, you just came on a bad question. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect first date. Hold your phone up so I can see the question. Uh, What's the perfect first date? <sighs> perfect first date. Typical rom com. We go to the movies to have dinner. <laughs> like you know, <laughs> you know, and then after the movie. We go, we end up somehow, we end up at the um, Ferris wheel. We're at the Ferris wheel. We're, we're at the, we're at the carnival. We we're at the, I, cause we, we don't live. Where'd the carnival come from? You have to go, it's a, um, in order to get a Ferris wheel, you have so to go So you're gonna wait to ask, uh, so you, you suggest to a guy to wait to ask a girl out until there is a fair in town. No, I'm not saying that. I'm saying you asked me what my perfect date was. Oh, so we no, have never like, had a perfect date. <laughs> no, perfect date was just there is no such thing as a perfect date. A perfect date 
to me is just being able to spend time with you, no matter the, the setting or situation. <laughs> it, with a Ferris wheel. <laughs> All right, next question, you guys. So, I can see the questions. You're not really good at it. I'm about to ask you. Okay, but I can see it. So, I can be Is taking go. too long to get ready annoying? Yes. Why? Because, yes. no, why? It just takes way too long. It just literally should take that long. Like I understand you're trying to get beat, you're trying to look good and all, but if I'm sitting ready to go and you got 30 more minutes to go, what am I gonna do for 30 Throw minutes? Throw back to a makeup video. That's what I'm thinking. Like, what am I gonna do for 30 minutes? Okay, well, okay, that's okay. It's It's annoying. It's very annoying. You know, it. imagine, imagine if you were ready to go okay. and I said, babe, I got to clean my shoes. And you had to sit there <laughs> 15 minutes like, a piece. Nah, you go shoe. with your shoes dirty. Okay, then. Okay, then. That's, that's, it. that's not even enough. <laughs> that's not even enough. Question. That's a common sense statement. What do you do if you're uninterested in a girl? Okay, sunshine. I don't know if I'm gonna answer this question. Um, what to do if you're uninterested in a girl? Mm -hmm. It depends. Talk to someone else. <laughs> Katie's trying to help me out. No. <laughs> like, <laughs> talk to the person about it. But hold up, 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 hold up. I could just, I could just send off vibes that I don't like that person. Be like, you know how girl, you know how no, every, what if they're not those vibes? You know how every single teeth girl shit is like, you're just a brother to me. What if I say that? You're just a sister to me. <laughs> Love you, sis. But let me tell you about this one girl, like, she, she ain't like, you know, if I did that. Some girls still don't. They're like, oh, I'm gonna try and change it in mind. If, if girl is on, if I'm uninterested <laughs> in a girl and she steady pursues me, I would just say, hey, I don't like it. But I would put it in a very sugar-coated way. That's what I would do. All right. Next question. Next question. Okay. Do guys pray for their future wives? Okay, I would say a good 20% of guys. 20-20? Because when guys pray, let me just be real. We praying for like sports. <laughs> That's it. That's all you pray for. No, there's, there's, there's more probably more than 20%. It's, it's... See, I can get in trouble with this question. <laughs> <laughs> oh no let's see I prayed for my future wife but I didn't d dwell on it I didn't pray every day but I would you know so I would say we pray for them not frequently but kind of my wife be out there making that money so when we get in a relationship I could just take out the money from her that's not how that works it is no, how it works stop. because because when your money when we get married your money become my money my money become your money but if I ain't got no money it's just off your money <laughs> 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 it's the truth okay next question do guys 
guys talk about girls the same way the girls talk about guys? What do y'all mean by that? Because I see Katie look at me from the other room. Um, actually, there was a real story. I'm gonna give it. I, I was on YouTube and on YouTube Shorts. There was a story where this girl was this this guy's wife was telling her friends about him, mm -hmm. but and the girl thought the guy would talk about her to his guys but he wasn't and it was like women assume we talk about uh girls to the guys it's like a good 20 percent of the time we talk about girls you like 20 percent huh like 20 percent is a good percent but 80 percent of the time we're just fooling around hey <laughs> hey but no no Guys, don't talk about girls as much as y'all think we talk about you. Because y'all probably be like, I wonder if he's thinking about me and talking to me to his friends. No, we're over there. Friends. Talking about Call of Duty and why the update sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Why would I care? Because I feel like I'm competing. It's a natural. It's it's a natural instinct of a guy to feel like you're competing, even if all those guys have no interest in your girlfriend. You still feel like you're competing. That's a solid answer. Yes. Pick up your phone. No, there's two things. There's two things. Worst thing a girl can do on a date. You can talk about another guy while you're on the date. Oh my gosh, my gosh, my girl. Talk about another guy on a date or pick up your phone and say something about a guy. But why not just pick up your phone and do it all? Okay. Um, like, there's a difference between y'all are talking about something and you have to look up something on your phone. Oh, show well, of course. Oh, that's, but, that doesn't fit, fit in the realm. You know what I mean. But, you, like, what if you're just, y'all are eating? Y'all aren't talking about anything, so you're just scrolling on Instagram. If you're on Instagram in the middle of a date, what is wrong with you? That's what I'm saying. Like, why does it just have to be talking about a guy? Like, why isn't it just being on your phone in general? Okay. Why do you slap her? <laughs> <laughs> if she's slapping my dog. It's not sure. Yes, it is. Sure. Why she ain't over there loving on you? Because he beat her. Yeah, she lets her stop. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, okay. The uh, uh, yeah, deal breaker. Yeah, if she gets on her phone and it, it has nothing to do with the conversation, and I'm sitting there talking, just pick up your phone. Check, please. It's on her. He just <laughs> That's exactly what I'm doing. Walk out. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think we got one more good question. I'm I'm sorry that you wouldn't do that, would you? No. Would you? No. No way. <laughs> Interrogation time, would you? No. Okay, bonus question. Oh my goodness. It's the last one. We still the last one's the last one. So we're gonna say a bonus question. <laughs> okay. All right. What's your biggest pet peeve? ASMR. I hate it. I hate ASMR. I love it. Yeah, and that's. You know I can't stand no mouse now. Like no, me and Trinity be on the phone, right? She'll be there eating, wrapping gown on whatever she eats, and she'll be. 
and I'm like, you know I don't like that sound. But sometimes it's worse than others. Sometimes I'll turn you all the way down and I can still hear you. That's so embarrassing. It's not like she, she's not, it's not really her smacking, but it's just a, like the chewing. I'm she just got a her, loud chewer. Like, she has her headphones in and just picks it. it up and it's just a, and I'm like, why? 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 But guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video yeah. <laughs> because this is some very, not tough, but they were pretty hard questions. They were, they were interesting questions, but, um, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Yep. Sus 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 subscribe, subscribe, subscribe guys. guys. Right, subscribe. We'll, we'll see you guys later. We love you guys. But more importantly, God loves you more. Peace. <laughs> What's more, it's never happened